The in-glass Maxil Pet Door by Security Boss Manufacturing is the best pet door available for in-the-glass installation. The Maxil in-glass model is for customers who want a high-performance pet door through glass. These doors are compatible with sliding glass patio doors, full-view glass hinge doors, and much more. The first step to install an in-glass pet door is to measure the width and height of the existing glass, including what is under the side, top, and bottom moldings. You will also need the glass thickness, as this info is required when ordering your pet door. Once you have this information, place your order for the new piece of glass with the notch cut out of the bottom left or bottom right corner of the glass. The required notch dimensions for each pet door size is available on our websites, brochures, and instructions that come with each pet door. Install the notched glass into the door and completely finish the glass portion of the installation. Next, you will begin to install the in-glass Maxil pet door. Included with your pet door will be an interior and exterior frame, a half inch or a one inch spacer, and pre-cut HDPE filler blocks. First, you will place the filler blocks into the channel of the door where the glass used to be located. This will provide the pet door frames with material to sandwich onto. Your pet door frames will sandwich the glass on the other two sides. The interior frame that houses the security panel will be on the inside of the house. The half inch or one inch spacer will be placed between the interior frame of the pet door and the surface of the glass. After the frames are tight into position, mark your pilot holes. They are located at the top, bottom, and both sides. Remove the frames from the glass when drilling to guard against glass breakage. Once you have mounted the frames and spacer, you will want to use a silicone sealant around the exterior frame to ensure a tight weather seal. Included with every in-glass max seal will be a one inch or a half inch spacer. The needed spacer size is determined by the thickness of the glass you have. With any single pane or dual pane glass that has a thickness that is three quarter of an inch or less, you will need to order the one inch spacer. For any glass thickness that is greater than three quarter of an inch, you will need to order the half inch spacer. The spacer is always installed between the interior frame of the pet door and the interior surface of the glass. You will notice that on one side of the spacer, there is a channel around the perimeter. The spacer will snap together with the interior pet door frame. This design allows for the spacer to be firmly in place once the two frames of the pet door are secured together. As a reference, when selecting the location for your in-glass pet door, look at the sliding glass doors from the inside of the house. Most sliding doors are made of a sliding and a fixed glass door panel. Depending on the manufacturer, the sliding door section may be situated towards the interior of the home or sometimes on the exterior. You will want to select the door panel regardless of fixed or sliding that is situated towards the interior of the home for your pet door installation. Selecting the interior door panel for your installation will keep the larger profile side of the pet door towards the interior of your room. The exterior frame has a 3 16 inch low profile frame so that it will slide past your fixed panel. This allows for full operation of your sliding doors. 